I save buying it, driving it, owning it, and selling it? That's fantastic. Toyota, a great value from start to finish and everywhere in between. So as the sport grows, there's always new innovations, new products coming out, uh, and definitely for lacrosse shafts. I'm here with Paul from Bamboo Shaft. Bam Shaft. Bam Shaft. Bam Shaft. Bam Shaft. Bam Shaft. I like that. He's got a <laughs> lot of excitement, a lot of energy, and he's going to tell us a little bit about his product. Okay. A year or two ago, I worked for a company that made bamboo rakes, bamboo handles for rakes and shovels. Okay, so we go to Home Depot, we try and sell this to Home Depot, right? Yep. And we know that bamboo is stronger than oak, we stronger than hickory, and it's lighter. So that's pretty cool. So you take the bamboo, you make a handle or a rake, and I thought of it because my daughter plays lacrosse, to come up with a bamboo lacrosse shaft. So what you do with bamboo is you take eight pieces, you laminate it together, Laminated is better, is stronger than solid wood. So it's laminated, heat treated, and pro patented process, patent pending process. And so you have a bamboo lacrosse shaft. The problem with bamboo lacrosse shafts is everybody thinks it's hollow in the middle, yeah. like this. So our new okay. advertising has a cross section, just like you see here, of okay. bamboo. Okay, so why, why bamboo? We know it's lighter than hickory and oak shafts, the old shafts that everybody else used, right? Number one. Number two, it's flexible. Whoops, excuse me. Yeah, you're all right. It bends and it flexes. Okay. So you can get some torque on it. So we're gonna advertise more whip, more flex, faster shot. Who, does, who doesn't want a faster shot? Everybody wants a faster shot. Okay. Everyone wants a harder hitting stick. You're not playing catch with a pipe. Yep. Like everybody else's, everything's a pipe. Yep. There's Easton over there, someone has a composite mm -hmm. with a with a wood veneer. Yep. All the wood feel without the splinters. Yep. That's not true. It can't be because it's not solid. Yep. So this is solid and people that use these, it, it feels completely different when you catch and throw. Because okay. it's solid. And most importantly, and everybody loves it, it's a Christmas morning smile. It hurts like heck when you hit somebody. <laughs> it hurts like heck. So you got something that's a little heavier than this is 10 ounces, 10 and a half ounces. Everyone's different, they're handmade. So you got 10 and a half ounces or so okay. versus eight ounces, and it just feels better. Yeah, yeah, they, they look fantastic, and it's such a cool feel, such a cool style. Yep. It's such some, something cool to have on the field. Everyone's going to look at it yep. and say, well, it does. you know. It sticks out like a sore thumb. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. I mean, and they're not legal, but a lot of the refs don't say anything about it. What are you going to do about it? I'm only it? kidding. Yeah. They're legal. <laughs> Good. Good to hear then. What's it? What shaft? Bam, Bam shaft. Bam. There shaft. we go. Now to customize your stick, this is probably the best way to do it. Uh, Wrap Sticks has been, I've seen it before, uh, it's an awesome concept. I'm here with Jamie and he's going to tell me a little bit about it. Hey guys, Wrap Sticks has been around for about three years and uh, what we do is a vinyl wrap for your stick. Simple to put on, it's a one piece application, take you about 90 seconds to put on. We have 32 stock designs, which you can see at uh, wrapsticks.com. Uh, and then we also do custom for team orders or individual orders. Our website has a custom design feature where you okay. can go in and design your own. Great. The custom wraps go for $9.99 and the, uh, or excuse me, the stock wraps on inventory go for $9.99. Okay. And then the custom wraps go for as little as $14.99. Oh, wow. All right. Definitely a cheap, easy, you know, affordable way to... You know, have your team stick out, a little bit of team unity, exactly. and have a lot of fun uh, out there on the field. It's oh. important as your uniform. Fantastic. That's great. All right. And it, it can be, and it yeah, will be absolutely. one day, and that's, that's awesome. So that's uh, right. look forward to seeing it on the field and a little more custom work. And it's good that kids can definitely have you know, the ability to you know, shine a little bit, have a cool logo, right. whatever. So. And when they come off, there's no sticky residue left on the stick. Great. It's a simple, simple application and removal process, but they won't, they won't come off during play. They're designed, the material's designed to chip and nick with stick checking, 
but it's not going to peel off or tear. Okay. When you're ready to take it off, you just peel it back, and there's no sticky residue. Great. Guaranteed. Fantastic. Okay. Awesome. Wrapsticks.com. Uh, we're looking at some training equipment, is that right? Yes. And um, I'm here with Kevin, who uh, is going to explain the fine uh, training equipment he has here. I have no idea what this stuff is. No, it's, uh, it's patented weighted training apparel. It's the only one like it in the world that actually has detachable sections. And what we do is you know, we got a half pound weight, so slide into these little pockets. All right. The bottom section here will carry 20 pounds, as you see on the mannequin. The upper section from here up will carry 10. Each sleeve carries two and a half. The great thing about it is you can manipulate the weight. You can move it around, front load it, rear load it. We have a lot of lacrosse teams that are just taking the upper section with 10 pounds and actually putting it underneath their gear and practicing with it. Okay. And over here is a yeah, ATI training shoe. Stop. It's a plyometric training shoe. What we're doing is, in a normal standing position, 70% of all your body weight is supported by the heels of your feet. Okay. We put you in the shoe, we're, we're eliminating that, forcing all 100% of your weight over your forefoot. So in essence, we're overloading the muscle groups that enable an athlete to run and jump. And by doing that, we're giving you a, a detailed training protocol. Uh, you, the workout is anywhere from 30 to 45 minutes, twice a week with a minimum of a 48 hour rest between workouts. After a three month time period, we guarantee you no less than two tenths of a second increase in your 40 time, increase of five to seven inches in your vertical, and an increase in anaerobic power and capacity of upwards of 500%. So basically you say it works? It works. Everything uh, we do is science based. All right, well, this is very interesting stuff. Uh, I really don't have anything else to say. I've never seen anything <laughs> like it. Well, thanks for your time. Appreciate it. Thank you. A little bit more of an innovative product. It's like a helmet for your helmet, or like a cover thing. And uh, I'm here with Stacy and the company's uh, Slick Lids. Slick Lids. Yeah. So what are you guys trying to accomplish with this? Well, the idea is that it's a uh, cover for the helmets, so that you can customize for your team. So we have all these different um, local teams that have already done them for either the rec council or camps or a club team, and you can put your logo on them and, and customize them, and then. These are just different fun designs. A lot of the women goalies like them to be unique and different. And um, we all have kids, and they like to stand out, and so they like all the wild ones. All right, well, that's cool. Um, so you guys can get, like, big team sales and everything? Yeah, we've been doing um, selling a lot to whole rec councils um, and different teams and what club, club teams, the camps are buying them as giveaways uh, in That's addition to jerseys. and. So if somebody uh, wanted to get in touch with you guys and get a slick lid, what would they, where slick would they go? Lid. Well, we do have a website, and it's uh, www.slicklids.com, okay. and um, that's how you do it. All right, guys. Well, if you want a slick lid, go to slicklid.com. I'm here at De Beer and um, the leading women's you know, producer, and they have a new stick this year, and we're just going to pretty much figure out what it's all about. I'm here with Elise. Um, so our brand new stick is called the Fierce. Um, it has a really narrow channel, as you can see. So it gives you great ball uh, retention, great ball control, and um, accuracy. So it's great for attackers. Um, and then it's definitely good for the draw as well. Okay. So yeah, it's a great stick. Um, and it, it's also, it's completely, it's the most advanced stick out on the market right now. All right. You guys always come out with some pretty cool stuff. Uh, is that actually out on the market so they can have it for this upcoming season? Yeah, you can you can get it right now. All right. And what's that called again? This is called the Fierce. All right. Look for the Fierce this season, guys. <laughs> Rocket Pocket has been here at the convention for years, forever. You can always come see what they have. Uh, it's been a staple of the convention. It's always fun to see them, familiar faces, uh, familiar designs. I'm here with uh, Mike and Flip. 
talk a little about what they have this year, uh, some shafts, and uh, and what uh, they have at the convention. Well, we got the rocket pocket. Um, it's pretty much the only really traditional sort of style pocket that isn't mesh anymore. Um, we've got um, some handles that, that we're producing and doing ourselves. Nice. And, and uh, these forearm sleeves that also are kind of a little bit different from anything. And we're just trying to like step out and get a little bit more um, product and, and, and identification and, and maybe bring back this whole traditional thing as the world has become much more of a mesh place. Um, and the rocket pocket's great because the ball stays in one spot and, and uh, the pocket rocks and it's very consistent and very good in all kinds of weather. And boy, we just have been so busy since we got here. It's just amazing. This is an incredible convention. It's incredible. I've come, been coming to this thing for like almost 25 years and the growth of the sport is reflected here, but it, it, it's just amazing how many coaches come to this thing now. Yeah, it's definitely uh, fun to see. You know, every year it's bigger and bigger. More people, new ideas. Um, a in, yeah, a lot of that. And uh, it's nice to see a company always holding down the traditional, you know, the traditional style and try to withhold that with younger players in the sport and stuff like that. You know, they, they kind of forget, didn't even know that this stuff used to be around, you know. Uh, and you were telling me that you used to have a lot more on the table earlier uh, yeah, we today. Yeah, we sell them out. We, you know, we're always thinking of something new. Dye jobs, colors are a very huge thing for a lot of kids. Uh, so we're always thinking of new ideas for colors, styles, and you know that's a very uh, another thing about Rocket Pocket is that not yeah. many people can do these type of dye jobs, and you know we have the technology and a lab and the and the people to do them. Uh, it helps a lot also for sales. Yeah, definitely. I mean, the colors look fantastic, and uh, everyone's always fan of the the Rasta dye job too. It's always fun to see the Rasta strange jobs. So uh, it was great talking to you guys, and uh, good luck to you. This is Justin from Battle Sports Science, and he, we're at the Baltimore Lacrosse Convention. And he's got some uh, some gear from Tap Out that he's introducing to lacrosse, and uh, I guess you can tell me a little bit about that. Uh, we make the uh, uh, performance and protective gear for Tap Out, and uh, uh, the first product we started with about a uh, about a year and a half ago was the mouth guards, and they've got they've really uh, exploded into uh, football, hockey, lacrosse. Um, what they are is the the two color mouth guards. Um, and they come in youth and adult. Uh, basically, you know, they're a boil and bite mouth guard, but they fit almost like a custom mouth guard. Okay. Uh, it's got a material in them that allows it to, to stay up real well. Uh, and, and that's the main thing with a mouth guard. You don't want it to be falling out. Yeah. Uh, they, they come two in a pack uh, with two straps in there. Uh, they work with and without braces. And um, like I said, the, the lacrosse world has really latched on them. They really, really like them. You know, they, all different sorts of team colors. We've got about 16 different color combinations, and you can see when I put this in, you can still talk about talk out of it. Yeah. Um, it locks in there. It stays up. Doesn't fall out, and it really secures your jaw as well. Your jaw is not going to slip back and forth. Um, so it's it's been a really good product for us. Um, the second product that we've just come out with are the uh, tap out performance bands, which have the, uh, uh, the the ions in there that work with your blood flow. And help oxygenate your blood flow, um, which helps in circulation and, uh, in many cases, flexibility, uh, strength. Um, kids really love these things. These are two in a pack. You can find them uh, for $24.99 at uh, all the lacrosse outlets, LaxWorld, lacrosse.com, um, you know, all the, all the lacrosse stores. Um, if you go to our website, tapoutmouthguard.com, you can just punch in your uh, zip code and you'll find out you know every place that has them in your area. Um, the last thing I want to talk about is uh, uh, our company Battle Sports Science is coming out with this product. Um, it's uh, called the Indicator and it's going to be ready for this football season and it'll, it'll be ready for next lacrosse season. And what it is, it's, uh, it's got these um, accelerometers inside of it, uh, inside the chin strap. and. It measures G-force and uh, the duration of impact. So what it does is, you know, it's not going to say, yes, this kid for sure has a concussion, but it's going to uh, say there's a probability that this kid has been hit hard enough to have a concussion. So what it does is it's, it's always green. The light is always green on the chin strap. 
When it starts blinking yellow, it'll blink for 45 seconds. There's a 51% probability of a concussion. Uh, blue, 70%. Red, 90%. Uh, we tested it at Battle Sport or at a uh, um, Sports Science Institute up in Fort Wayne, Indiana, which you see on ESPN. Yeah. Um, and uh, you know they loved it. They loved the idea. The test went great. We also recently tested it at the U.S. Army All American Bowl with all the top high school football players down in San Antonio, um, and, it, and it went great there. So um, this is going to be a big thing that's really going to help uh, indicate the possibility of a concussion. You know, a player can say, "Hey, coach, this guy's just blinking." Um, let's take an injury timeout, have him checked out, and uh, if he's good, have, send him back in. If not, you know, he's got to sit out. So we'll have it uh, this football season and next lacrosse season we'll have it. Yeah, it's a great safety feature, especially with all the concussion awareness now that's going on Absolutely. in the NFL and, and elsewhere in lacrosse also. Absolutely. And they got um, some great products. Apparently those work. I've seen them on a lot of people that are growing in popularity, and they got some uh, great mouthpieces uh, from Top Out. So I uh, appreciate your time. Yeah, and also we're going to be coming out with a uh, uh, thank you. I appreciate yeah. it. We're going to be coming out with a lot more products, about 30 new products this year. Uh, compression gear with the padding, um, equipment bags, uh, all kinds of stuff for lacrosse. So we're yeah, really so excited to be a part. Tap out is making its way into lacrosse. So be prepared. All right. Thank you very much. Yeah, thanks a lot.